Good afternoon, landing crew. Today is a day that we are going to go into Walmart and we are going to go shopping. Now, this isn't your normal grocery store haul because I'm actually not gonna be showing groceries. I'm gonna be showing everything else but groceries. So the non-edible items that you need to kind of start life over, right? For those who have not been watching, my husband and I have been married for 18 years. We are separating, we have six kids. I'm leaving a lot of things behind. So I'm gonna go in there and just get a bunch of things that you need like toiletries and just random things, cleaning supplies. I figured I would do it as a haul and show you guys. I don't even know if anyone wants to see this stuff, but I'm gonna show it to you anyway. Okay, so let's go. Many hours later. All right, guys. We are done. Yes, we are. Now we just have to go to the new house and unpack all of this stuff and show you guys. We are back guys. I'm ready to show you all the things we got. Ignore the echo, we're still moving in. But again, these are non-grocery food items. There are some things I bought here that I'm sure we have at the house, but at this point it's easier for me to just buy everything new, clean, clean slate and just kind of start over. So this is kind of our starting over non-grocery haul. I will also be doing the grocery haul because the grocery haul will be crazier, but let's do it. So we have a scale. Um, I actually bought two plungers because we don't have any and there's four bathrooms in this house. Um, this is more for the bigger cleanup because we are assembling a lot of furniture and just because they're huge trash bags that we need. Um, I got a lot of these. You'll see a lot of these. I think I got like four or five and then we got some <laughs> Glade plugins. I bought a new hairbrush. Isn't that so cute? Just love it. Um, Listerine. You will see doubles of like Listerine toothpaste, things like that, because my adult daughter lives in the basement here. So there's some things just specifically for her. Then there's things for our bathroom, the kids' bathroom, all of that. We got two Listerines. We got some kids, kids Aquafresh. Come on, focus, focus. Come on. There we go. This is deodorant for my 15 year old. I ran out of this. I don't even know where my nail polish removal is. Gel for my six year old or whoever else needs it. These are for my daughter because she has really thick hair. Then we got some Gain soap for the kitchen. These are kind of hard to show, but this is a broom and a dustpan. It actually comes with two, two brooms. This is for my SV. It's basically a snow brush and an ice a nice scraper for your windshield. This is a curtain rod that is actually gonna go right there. And these are the curtains that are gonna go with them. Okay, just bought a few dish towels. That's one thing that I really need to pick up was dish towels and some pot and pan holders. Got some leggings, they're so cute. We make like different water bottles for cleaning. So this is what I did there. Um, small trash bags for the bathroom. More of the glades. <laughs> Dryer sheets. If you notice, we have a theme and it is Gain Moonlight Breeze. Q-tips, foil. Uh, this is for my son, it's a body wash. This is also for my son, it's dry shampoo. For those who are new, we are a large family. I have six children for special needs, so dry shampoo can be very helpful for individuals with sensory issues that may, be, may not be able to tolerate washing their hair every day or every other day. So these are for the little kids because I have a bunch of curly head, curly head little ones. I had to get a new, a new razor, just some pain removal. A lot of these things I feel like are just like everyday things, but I'm gonna show them regardless. This is for Danielle's room, um, her door to the, the basement. It's gonna have a key. So it will be right here because right now like anyone can go down into the basement. This is a bath sponge I got for myself. The kids floss, more kids toothbrushes. They use some for therapy and then they use some in their bathroom. So I decided to get a double pack. Uh, Danielle did not have one of these in her bathroom. So I got her one. This is also Danielle's um, conditioner. There we go. Same type of shampoo. Tums for heartburn. Pepto, because one of my children have stomach aches on a regular basis. Got me some rubber bands, some Ziploc bags. 
This is for Noah, my 15 year old. He has one of these, but I don't know what happened to it. This is Clorox wipes for our nanny. She just goes through and cleans everything. So wipes is something that really helps her just stay, stay on top of things and it's more convenient. Uh, this is toothpaste for my daughter and I. They're like the little heads to these. And we got two in case we lose one. Pumpkin. Pumpkin Glade fill-ins. These are my floss. Just some foam soap. A box cutter because we are running into that as an issue. This is my daughter's body wash she picked out. Just some cleaning supplies, toilet bowl. I did forget a few things, but Lime Away, Windex, 409, um, Fabuloso. They had a blue one. I've never tried the blue one, so we're gonna try that. I usually try the purple or pink. Um, I also got some some scent booster, some scouring pads. This is my body wash I got. It smelled really good. I didn't realize that it was, you know, an age embrace, but it's okay because it smells amazing. Healing ointment, the kids mouthwash, cotton balls. All right, we got some shampoo two in one. This is also for my son that I got the dry shampoo for. He just struggles with sensory, so I try making bath and shower time as easy as possible. Um, we got some bleach, some paper cups or plastic cups, paper plates. Um, we usually don't use those that often, but it's gonna be some crazy times, guys. It's gonna be some crazy times. So we are all about the convenience. You know, you got that moonlight breeze, <laughs> laundry detergent. Dawn, this is gonna be specific to fill up these. My husband is keeping all the tools, so I really wanted just like a screwdriver set just for things around the house. I'm sure I'm gonna need to build this up more. And then we got dishwasher things. This is for my shower. Isn't that so cool? Got toothbrushes for my daughter and I. The kids' soap dispenser is foaming, so I got, I got these. Just Ziploc bags. Oh look, Fabuloso. I wanna try these out. The trash can we're getting is actually 20 gallons, but we'll just make it work. And then some off-brand Mr. Clean erasers and, oh, toilet paper, paper towels. I think that's it, guys. I think that's it. Cannot wait to get furniture and rugs in here so it doesn't be so echoey, but you know, we gotta wait for those things to come. So we are just going to make the best of it and put these things up. We actually don't move in for like a week, but we are trying to get it where when we bring the kids in, the transition is as seamless as possible. I'm sure I forgot a few things, but I feel like this is gonna set us up in a good place where we don't have to worry about, oh, did I leave this at the house, that at the house kind of thing, because it's a lot different. If, if you've never done this type of thing, like it's a lot different than everyone's moving, everything's going in boxes, everything's going in the truck. It's easier to forget things when everything isn't going. And I'm trying not to do the thing where we're constantly going back to the house. We're just gonna kind of have a fresh start and it was definitely expensive. I look at the stuff and I'm like, how is this $800? But of course I did get some other things like the curtain rod, curtains, scale, like just a lot of things that just adds up very, very, very quickly. Thankfully, this isn't something we'll have to do on a regular basis. Let me know if you like these kind of holes because I'm sure I'll have to do more in the future, but um, this was fun. I love you guys and we will see you guys next time. Where you move, make me blind. You will always be there. There's no doubt in my mind. You will always be there. Heading out to see ya and leave the rest behind. Oh, oh, oh. Cause you will always be there.